Hey guys, this is David back from the most exciting and fun SHOT Show ever, where I captured over 50 new gear videos and interviews, including a daily behind the scenes documentary vlog, so you can see for yourself what SHOT Show in Las Vegas is really like. So over the next four weeks, I'll release 10 to 15 of the best videos from the show to YouTube, including exclusive interviews and first looks at new guns, knives, and gear that I found for you at the show. But if you can't get enough of SHOT Show and want to check out all 50 videos from the show this year, click the link on your screen or in the video description to grab your free subscription to the Ultimate Survival Tip Show on Carbon TV, where I'm posting 10 new SHOT Show videos every week until all 50 videos are up and ready for you to check out exclusively on the Ultimate Survival Tip Show on Carbon TV. I think you're going to like what I've got queued up in this video, so let's get started. So I'm here at Buck Knives with Joe. Joe, thanks again for having me. Thank you, Dave. Really appreciate you taking the time. Yeah, thank you. And this is, we're going to talk about something really intriguing, especially for you survival guys that Buck came out with. But we're going to do three videos today. This is just one of three. So for the other products that we're looking at, check the video description and check the channel. Right. So what are you going to look at now? I'm excited about this. I'm going to introduce to you today our kinetic series of spears. We have three different spears, and I'm going to go through them one by one, show you what they do, how, how they look mounted, and uh, just talk about them a little bit. Okay, cool. Let's do it. The uh, first one is the 071 Hunt Spear. It comes out of the box, looks like this. Uh, the main feature here you can see is there's uh, some plastic pieces that are covering the business ends of this, uh, this tool. Pretty easy to undo. Paracord on this side, just pull it through the, the little pinch grab there, loosen it up and uh, off comes one end on this point end here and then another off of the chisel point. Now the design of this is for small to medium sized game. This point right here, this spear point is designed to pierce ribs, not bounce off the animal but find its way through. You'll notice on the end we have this chisel point. And this chisel point allows you to get the spear into the stick. You have to provide your own stick, which I'm sure you're not too hard to find out in the woods. Uh, I have a couple mounted here, so I'm going to show you what it looks like when it's ready to go. Now, if you have your own stick, <laughs> pound this down in until it finds itself seated into the wood. Now, one of our guys who prepared these, uh, these samples actually wrapped the stick with the paracord, which comes on the sheet, wrapped the stick with the paracord first, and then mounted the spear into it. Tighten up that paracord first, and then as you pound this spear in, it really wedges because through. You have the wedge there to really get it in there. Right, tightens up this paracord very tightly. That's a good idea. You can feel that this is not coming out. Even if I step it on the ground quite a bit, you don't feel it going in or out after it's been wedged in there. That's the 071 Hunt Spear. Next on the list is the 072 Gig Spear. Very similar in look, same sheath configuration. Let's pull that out. Uh, except that you'll notice that this one is a two-tined fork, very similar to a frog gig that you might have used in the past. Um, when the frog gig that I had as a kid was little wires off of a cone, and you know that broke pretty pretty, pretty quickly. <laughs> you know, one throw, you miss your frog, and you're you're done. So this is. Uh, Made of solid steel, it's not going to break on you. It's and it looks like it's, the amazing thing is that these, you could take down a buffalo with these, maybe. But <laughs> you get it in there for you sure. You get it in there for sure. <laughs> but it almost looks like a uh, quarter inch, close to quarter inch. Uh, close to quarter inch. We're at about 200 thousandths here, just under, just under a quarter of an nice. inch. That's very rigid, tool. very firm. The one I have mounted up here, I'll show you. Here's how it looks. Same configuration as the last one. Stick, wrapped it with the paracord, got the, the wedge right here, and then just pound it down in, get that nice firm grasp on the, on the spear itself. This is ready to go. You know, the sticks that we have here today are a little short because uh, we had to ship them to the SHOT Show, but yep. uh, we spent a lot of time at Buck Knives out on the side yard of the building, big grassy spot, we set up a target, uh, we experimented with sticks of various lengths, four to eight feet, and threw these things around for quite a long time, developing 
Uh, the, the shapes yeah. that you see here, all, make sure they work. All that research, research and development, rough life. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it got to be about two, three hours a day at throwing spears, but uh, <laughs> that's the way it goes for product development, right? Uh, anyway, that's the 072. So if you want to have fun and you're talented, come see Joe. <laughs> come see he might you. have a job for Send you. Send me your resume. Yeah. <laughs> uh, last on the list is the 074 fishing spear. This one's a little more involved than the last two, with more pieces. Uh, but basically the same concept. We want to take off this covering to reveal the two pieces, two pieces of the spear. The beauty of this is that these two lock in like this to form a four-point Poseidon-like spear. It does have the same chisel on the back that the other two have. And the sample that I have mounted up here, you can see uh, same process. Find your stick, get your paracord. This one takes a little more effort to wedge down into the stick, but you can get it. The key is to make sure that the, the stick intersects with this upper wedge right here, which really drives this removable piece into the seat, make sure it won't move or, or slide on you while you're using it. The beauty of this is that the, uh, the, the sheet, the covers that came with it when it was flat, can be fashioned into a cross and put on to the, sheet, or the spear once it's mounted in a piece of wood to give you a little extra protection while you're going through the woods. You know, it'd be kind of a tragedy or really take the fun out of your day if you were to fall yeah. on this and yeah, get hurt. Really. So, uh, yeah. um, That's a really nice consideration. You know, we try to make sure that uh, everyone is uh, safe using our products. Obviously, there's uh, some user expertise that goes along with this. You know, going out and throwing these is going to take a little bit of practice. We recognize that some people are just starting out in their adventures out in the woods. So we want to make sure that everyone has an opportunity to have fun and be safe and, and enjoy the products and not feel like they, uh, they did something that was a big error, a big mistake. Yeah. So. yeah. And they come separate or together? They come separate. Okay. So the, these two retail for $55 okay. MSRP, and this one is $80 MSRP. Okay. So you'll see them in the range of you know 45 bucks for these guys, and this one's probably going to be... $59 or so in retail. Awesome. Awesome. Really like that. And guys, let me know what you think in the comments section. It'll be interesting exactly. to get some feedback. Feedback would be great. You know, we try to push the envelope a little bit, but we know we can't please everybody, so yeah. we can improve this along the way. That'd be great. Yeah, and we'll pass it along to you. Great. Thank you very much, Dave. Joe, thanks, thanks again for being with me. Thank you. Appreciate it. Have a great show. Thanks. For your convenience, I've included links to all the gear that we've mentioned in the video description. Just click the Show More tab under this video. And for all 50 of our SHOT Show 2016 videos, click the link on your screen or in the video description for your free subscription to the Ultimate Survival Tip Show on Carbon TV. Thanks for watching.